Hi guys, um, today's review, I want to do um, a, a special one. Um, it's a company called Peace by Chocolate in Canada. Uh, this family is originally from Syria. Um, they're a family of chocolatiers. Um, they actually been, had been making chocolate um, in Syria and the Middle East for over 20 years, both the father of the family. Um, and then what happened was is that their uh, chocolate factory got bombed, so they had to flee Syria and go to Lebanon, and they were there for a few years, and then when they came to Canada, um, they st restarted their uh, chocolate company. They've also been mentioned by our Prime Minister, Justin Trudeau, at the United Nations. Um, and just a great story behind this chocolate. So, um, in the, and they're based out of, oh, I can't pronounce this, Sorry guys, that's my frog coming out. They're based out of a town in Nova Scotia. I'm going to put it in the description. I am. That's just my frog coming out there. Uh, people don't know what that means. I'm half French Canadian, so some words I just have trouble saying. Um, so I do apologize, guys. But anyhow, this is what the box looks like here. Practicing for my thumbnail. Sorry, guys. Okay, let's open this up. Um, before I do that, this is like a variety pack of chocolate bunnies. You see, I don't know if you guys can see there. They have these, this on the back here. I'm going to look here. I'm not sure what that is. Oh, almonds. Okay, so these are pieces of almond on the back. That's really interesting. I'm just going to try the white one for now, I think, because um, I think those are almonds. Yeah. Sorry, guys. I didn't realize these did not come attached to anything inside here. Oh, my goodness. Really? Okay. Give me one second, guys. <sighs> I hard to get out of the box here. Okay, and these ones are, looks like, is it like hazelnuts? I think those are hazelnuts. And then these ones are cashews. You can tell that one's the dark chocolate. So there's dark chocolate, white chocolate, and milk chocolate. And there are seeds in here. Um, so it says, grow your own violets inside. So they give you some seeds. I'll try and grow these, but I'm not very good with plants, so some of you know, so we'll see how well that goes. Um, I'm just going to try a bite of each one, and i got to put these back in the fridge. They're already melting. So I'm going to try a piece of the white one first. Mmm. That's good. I love how they put those nuts on the outside. Mmm. Yeah, definitely almonds. So, five out of five for the white. Next, we'll try the milk chocolate. Mm. Mm. I like that they put the nuts in the back. That's definitely unique. I've never seen that. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Well, that one, a four out of five, the last one, but then just because I'm not really a fan of dark chocolate, but you guys might really like it. Um, 
I know they have a website, so I'm going to include that in the description because they do ship internationally. Um, here in Nova Scotia, you can get a uh, piece by chocolate at Sobeys. Um, I'm not sure about the rest of Canada. I, I don't know. If you shop at Sobeys, um, just look to see if they have it there. If not, you can order from their website. Um, I encourage you guys really to check their chocolate out. Not only is it good chocolate, it has a really um, amazing story behind it. Like, basically, the, it's like a phoenix rising from the ashes. This family just rose back up from the ashes to rebuild their uh, chocolatier business. I think that's amazing. Um, I really encourage you guys to check out their chocolate. It's really good. Each one I tried. Um, I was so busy enjoying it. I didn't really say what I thought of it. It wasn't too sweet at all. My favorite though is white chocolate, but then I love white chocolate, right? Um, the milk chocolate wasn't too sweet at all. I love the nuts on the back. I thought there's a really unique touch there. Um, I really encourage you guys to give them a shot and check it out there. Um, don't forget guys to hit your like on the way out. Um, sh subscribe and hit that bell if you're not subscribed yet. Um, don't forget to check my social media links in the description as well as the other uh, channels that I've listed there. And I hope you guys have a great day. Bye guys.